Well, we, we deliberately um, opened, we got a, a, an opening uh, premiere in a, a, a theatre which was normally, as you say, a white theatre. And then that uh, uh, aroused some kind of ambivalence. So we decided that the best thing to do was to run that for the benefit of African causes which it, it, it was very successful in doing. It attracted a lot of attention and the stars of the film actually appeared on the stage and things like that. So, so that it, it got a lot of publicity and got a lot of exposure. And then it was uh, shown to the black audiences in the townships where it practically created a riot. It was so successful that they, they were tremendously enthusiastic and, and pleased with that film. That, that, that continued, but what happened in the interim was that we really hadn't realized that we were treading heavily on the feet or toes, if you like, of the uh, commercial organizations. Uh, it, it hadn't occurred to us that what we were doing, we were making a film for, say, 5,000 pounds in those days, and they were buying a film for 50 pounds and distributing it and making enormous profit. So they were not a bit pleased to find that we had a, a successful film, but that film <laughs> had cost all that money. They didn't want to spend that money.